The CUPP secretary says the award represents the view of many Nigerians who saw sincerity and integrity in Peter Obi during the 2023 elections. It represents the, the extraordinary, undefeated spirit of the Nigerian people. The Nigerian people were very committed in 2023. Obi came, up, came into the election with integrity, with sincerity, and with track record of, work, of working for the people. And that record, both in public and private sector, was enough, was enough to propel him, was enough for people to see that level of sincerity, and saw that thing, and then queue behind. Because before people want to decamp to political parties, they are looking for parties that have governor, parties that have senators. Look at what happened that a party without structure, a party that was not well standing, the Nigerian people took it and took it up to number one party. And that was because of the integrity of the person that was on the ballot. He said unnecessary waste by government has resulted in the high cost of living and insecurity. Level of mismanagement, if you look at the budget of the National Assembly, when you have 15 million billion, billion, billion naira for library, 13 billion for, for car park, 15 billion for our hospital that is residing within the National Assembly. If you look at the cost of waste, even what Ali Ndume said, whether they talked about the renovation of the National Assembly sitting chamber, when you talk about 45, 45 or 80, 48 billion naira, and it is all poorly done. So the kind of waste that exists in our, in our system that's deprived the, honorary, the child of the honorary man in the street for having basic amenities that would have improved, made their life a better a better one in a society that we are one of the largest producers of crude oil in the world. The organizers say the award is in recognition of the champions of democracy whose unwavering dedication has given the hope that Nigeria will be great again. You may not be in power, but you may be the special advisor, special assistant, neighbor, friend, brother, relative or uncle of those in power. You have a duty to tell them what is right and tell them what the truth is. Don't window coat it. Say it as it is. If people are dying, tell them people are dying so they can amend their policies. Cobden, as an independent political action group, was formed by Nigerians inspired by the urgent need to contribute to the development of the nation. Oge, Ihimekme, AIT News, Abuja.